contracted circa 1835. Ferdinand Beanstone, let's go there. That's the beach. I'm assuming it's pretty low tide at the moment. Oh, this is cool. The window. Marina Lake just to the right down there. God, these rocks are quite incredible. So I wasn't planning on it, but I've just um had a quick look at the Clevedon Marine Lake and it just looks lush and the weather's like suddenly uh, it's got kind of warm so and it stopped raining so I'm just going to go for a quick swim give it a go yeah we'll give it a review out of seven Made it. The water wasn't too bad actually. Yeah, I'll definitely come back here again. It's just the uh, the water is so much warmer than like the normal river, uh, which is always good for me because yeah. I didn't do a length. Yeah, I just went across the width basically. Um, it's differing depths, but there's like a map that shows you. I think that's Cardiff just opposite. Definitely going to come back here, that was great, loved it. It was kind of warm, it, well it was alright, like the temperature was fine considering it's been raining a week and there were like some nice people there and yeah, um, it's kind of got that like, like a slightly seaside -y feel about it um, but also yeah there's no like strong currents or anything because I guess it all just like overflows into the, the sort of swimming marine bit. Yeah, give it what? 5.4 out of 7. Uh, I just don't want to overcomplicate things, so yeah, 5.4. Yeah, I think it might be the only time that I didn't have any swimming shorts in my vehicle. So I just had to like buy a pair. So maybe I should give a review for the swimming shorts. I'll give them, you know, they're pretty good to be fair. Can't really complain, 6 quid, as do. Um, yeah, we'll give them we'll give them a five out of, a solid five out of seven. Uh, you know, legs went in and that.
bit of a late night wander. Don't normally end up wandering around this lake. Yeah, there's lots of music going on over the other side of the docks as well. I don't know, it's, yeah. I really wasn't expecting so much. I don't know what I was expecting, really. It's like I've never been out before. Right. Uh, yeah, there's just like so much light and colour everywhere. Um, and I think, uh, you know, it's probably because it's dry as well, warm, and everyone's out. In a couple of months, it's going to be like a totally different sort of scene. Yeah, this is really the best the absolute best weather that you could get. I think only now I've finally got used to just like wandering around um, other people and just talking on my phone, which is quite nice. Um, it didn't take very long. I'd recommend just trying to do this, like for anyone who's interested in like starting a channel or filming or anything like that. Uh, you basically just have to stop caring. It's kind of difficult at first, but I don't know. I mean, when it, when it's like really busy, it's it's basically quite hard to kind of hear yourself think anyway, but when it's like this, it's not too bad. Like, I think quite a lot of the other places that I've shot in, certainly in the first couple of videos, it's been really quiet, which does help quite a lot. But yeah, um, it's kind of just quite, yeah, quite interesting dynamic here. So what's this one then? Oh, there's like a cafe in there. one for another day. It's quite large. There must be literally hundreds in this city. Oh, I think I've got to go down there anyway. <laughs> 